Welcome to this new Visual Basic lesson. In today's lesson, we will learn about the sort and the reverse method. I have the previous project open. I added two buttons. The first button, I set its text property to sort and its name property to btn sort. The second button, I set its text property to reverse and its name property to btn reverse. I'm gonna come here and double click the sort button to create a click event. Okay, before I do anything here, I'm gonna go to the top and I'm gonna create a string array. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna say dim str countries. Okay, and set its size to five as string countries with the E here okay and uh, you can use dim here or you can use private it's up to you all right there is no harm if you use dim and you can also use private it's up to you okay I'm gonna come here and uh, add the elements to this uh, array and say str countries and then first one is gonna be United States All right, then I'm going to copy this, press Ctrl-C and press Ctrl-V a couple of times to add more elements. I'm going to say here Canada and here I'm going to say Mexico. I'm going to come here and say Qatar. I'm going to come here and uh, change this to Germany and last one I'm gonna change it to Egypt all right now I'm gonna change the positions here so this is one this is two three four sorry four and five here okay what I'm gonna do I'm gonna grab this press Control C come here and press Control V and of course change this to say uh, str countries okay str countries all right uh, so far so good I'm gonna press save and run it okay Make sure everything is working it's working now let's uh, sort it according to the alphabetic order so I'm gonna come here and say array and and here uh, the intelligence you have all these uh, functions and methods to choose from okay whenever you see a 3d box it means it's a method or a function uh, whenever you see curly brackets it means it's a namespace and whenever you see a wrench it's a property and uh, make sure you get used to these dot net icons it's very helpful to know what uh, what they mean okay so I'm gonna say that sort okay I'm gonna choose the sort okay and I'm gonna tell it which array I want to sort I'm gonna say uh, the str countries okay all right so press save button and run it I'm gonna come here and press the sort button and now I have it in alphabetic order so Canada Egypt Germany Mexico Qatar and United States okay that's the way to use the sort method in uh, Visual Basic okay let's now come here to the design view and double click the reverse button to create a click event and uh, I'm gonna take this alright everything here I'm gonna take all of this come here control C control V and instead of saying sort I'm gonna do this I'm gonna say reverse okay so here if you press the dot here you choose this one the reverse 
and basically we use the array dot reverse method to reverse the sequence of the elements okay so now I'm gonna uh, press save and come here run it okay and press reverse and it's in the reverse order all right as you can see it starts from here from Egypt and it goes up instead of going from United States down it does it from the bottom to the top it reverses the order uh, it's you will probably get a better idea if I do this and comment this out okay and come here and uh, bring this this uh, integer array okay and what I do here I'm gonna take this and say uh, array okay that reverse okay and I say int now int int numbers okay all right so let's uh, press save save all run it come here and press the reverse and it's in the reverse order it starts from 30 to 5 and if we clear the box here and we go for example to this one as you can see it's it's regular sequences from 5 all the way to 30 all right let's clear this box and reverse it and here it's from 30 to 5 basically this is how you use the sort and the reverse method uh, in Visual Basic I thank you for watching and you have a good day